Hi, super innovators. This month we have the topic about gender equality for innovation. So we are doing this in February. So in March, you are full ready, full of tools to make the International Women's Day. You know, like all the companies are coming every month now with new topics, new strategies for gender equality. So this is for you now. So gender equality for innovation. First point and question. Establish KPIs to track performance with data because from the KPIs, you will find the right strategies and programs. In this case, it's gender equality. So gender equality for innovation, I will add how you can track how many concepts are created by women and how many concepts by men, after how many prototypes are created by women and how many prototypes by men, but as well when you are selecting. And the other way around is the decision makers. You can have another KPIs like how many experts are making the decision on if this concept is going to prototype, you know, the very easy front end of innovation management. So this is a way of how you can establish KPIs and then how you are going to make the strategies to match these KPIs. Second point, second exercise, create a gender factor. When you select a contract from a technology or you contract an expert or a program or book or speakers or vendors or other solutions or mentors or participants in a room, describe here below in your workbook how you can apply the gender factor inside your team, your department and your organization. For instance, you know, procurement, you have to buy a solution. So why not to create the gender factor to have, okay, all the commercial proposals, the RFIP, RFII has to be all the companies a gender plan, gender equality plan. And you can say as well, like you want to have RFIPs and RFIs, like I 50% are led by women companies. So women leaders and 50% are men. So that is like, oh my God, what are you doing, Hara? Yes, it is like this if you want to create a gender factor. But you can apply this for panels you are doing in your organization, for experts you are hiring or programs or other mentors. So if you want to have a room full of equality, so you, you try to have this as a KPI and as well as a gender factor, like we apply gender factor everywhere. So this is okay. Then it's like you think in a different way. So this is the exercise. So third exercise, write down the new strategies to ensure gender balance in the decision makers to select ideas, concepts, prototypes, or create programs. What does it mean? So it's like we discussed at the beginning. So you have one way of measuring KPIs and establishing KPIs for gender, concepts led by women, we can say prototypes led by women, but as well, you have to be more strategic in the other way around for gender balance. So the decision makers, how many decision makers you can add in your team of experts to make decisions are 50-50. That's all, very simple. This is only one page exercise for you to think in a completely different way about gender equality for innovation. Very structured, very clear, very super going to the point. And well, you know, this video and this PDF is because you subscribe to our collab with resources. So you can do it collabwith.com slash newsletter. But as well, you can find them inside the Collab with platform in the section resources in, the, in your dashboard. And who I am, so I am Hara Pascual. I am the CEO of Collab with and as well the author of the book, Innovation and Collaboration in the Digital Era. So a book full of methodologies, how to create a collaboration, how to negotiate a collaboration, how to create your own innovation ecosystems. And via these resources, I am explaining all the concepts of the book, but as well, new methodologies about innovation you can apply right away 
when you are learning this month. So you can focus one month in one topic very easy when with this PDF of exercises and the video to explain as well how the exercises work and sometimes well you know you have these inspirational podcast interviews and other interviews to help you you know to get different perspective different ways of doing things to increase your levels of creativity and innovation so see you next month with our next topic and our next topic this next month is innovation and human resources very nice so see you super innovators the next month with our next collab with Resources.